Cold IPA is all about the expression of the hops. But we're hybriding what we're using a lager, a lager being lager malts, it's got Pilsner yeast, and it's got rice. So that helps give all the character and depth flavor to be exploded and bursted with all the hops. We've used a Pilsner yeast, and we fermented it at ale temperatures. We've used our experience from our NEPA series last year of how to use hops at their very best in terms of using during high fermentation, lagering them on the hops uh, and making something that's a hybrid. The style is a hybrid, really soft, gentle water profile. And the hops that we've got here, we've got in big, we've got in hard. Start of the year, we've got Idaho 7, we've got Galaxy and we've got Simcoe. And let's go through and taste it and see what the beer looks like. So this has been lagered for a period of time and we've hoped to get a really light, bright beer in colour. And we should have a nice foamy head on here as well. So it's again frothy like a good lager. Absolute explosion of hops on the nose. You might expect this not an expression on a, on a Nipa. Uh, but when you drink it and, and follow through, amazing, lovely mouthfeel. It's not too thin, it's not too dry, it's 8.4, so there was a balancing act here. It drinks like it should be 5 or 6%. It's so easy to drink. And then you get this long, gentle bitterness that is, in my opinion, perfectly supported with how dry the beer is and making you want to drink more. It's not a West Coast, it's not an East Coast, it's not a lager, but you've got all these attributes that come together. It's not too sweet, it's not too dry, but again, it's all about the expression of the hops. On the can, we have, so part of our IPA tour is working with fantastic local creatives. We've used Snap Clicker for the first one. He is a visual artist doing many different uh, memes of art. He's done this just up the road from us on a wall, which is very hard to find in Brighton. But part of the series is using different creatives is to do a large canvas where they're going to do their work on. And at the end of the year, we're going to do a big charity auction. And all the money goes to Audio Active, which is supporting young people getting into the music industry and putting a positive focus in their life where they may not already have. So it all goes back into the pot for creativity in our local area. Um, I really hope you try, try this beer and really enjoy it. We absolutely love it and has changed our thought process and what we're going to do with IPAs in the future. Cheers.